My experience about online danger once I was threatened by the internet by being taking some of my picture in my private Facebook account by use for online trading. The online store took my photo to use as a review of their Diet Pills brand. They claim as I am using their pills to lose my weight. But actually, I didn't know or even took any pills. And in addition, they also claim that if you use their product, you can lose weight like me, as you can see in the picture. So, this can consider as an online trade. And it was not only me that was threatened by this brand. And I am already informed to the police that I was threatened by the internet. How to protect yourself from identity theft? First one, check your privacy and security system on your social networking profile and never give away your account details. Learn more about protecting your personal information and privacy. Second one is use strong unique passwords. For each online account, the personal information you put in your social networking profile could even be used by scammers to, to guess your password. Third one is don't accept requests to connect from strangers. The best way to keep scammers out of your life is to never let them in. Fourth, don't use public computers to access your personal information. Always remember to clear the history, close the web browser, and log out before you leave. Fifth, don't use Wi-Fi hotspot for sensitive internet use, as they are often not secure. Learn more about using public Wi-Fi network safety. Six, check your account statements, including credit cards, bank statements, telephone, and internet bills for possibly fraudulent activity. And the last one is, check your credit report at least one a year. This can help you catch any unauthorized activity. There are so many types of online threat. The common ones are viruses, malware, hacking, including identity theft. As we mentioned before, it is a serious crime. And for example, of the term you may not know is phishing. Phishing is the way that criminals steal your confidential information, like a password for an internet banking, by sending you a fraudulent emails or messages. Next one is ransomware. Ransomware is uh, the one type of malware that makes your files or your computer unable to use unless you pay for it. There are a few steps to protect you away from the online threat. First one is install your anti-virus software. It's a very easy one. The next one is to back up your data and to browsing your website safely. Next is not to send a sensitive data via the hotspot or a public Wi-Fi. The next one is to, to make your password strong and do not send them away. Keep it to yourself and check it regularly. When you are sharing a file, make sure your file are seen by your colleague and someone you want them to see. And the last one is think before you post, because once your information are online, it is almost impossible to be deleted. And that's all for our presentation on online thread. Thank you for watching.